Hello people YouTube, this is Mr. Bernie C and welcome back to some more Let's Play Pokemon Snap. Last time we got ourselves a Dash Engine and we got ourselves a new assignment from um, Professor Oak. So the assignment, if I didn't show you last time, is to come take pictures of Pokemon signs. So far we have no Pokemon signs, so this is pretty self-explanatory to take pictures of um, um, things that look like... Um... Oh, and actually gives you a description here. I, didn't, I actually did not know that. Well, anyways, we're going to go ahead and go to the first course and see if we can find any Pokemon signs. Well, actually, there's one for each course, but I'm not going to spoil that. So, on our way to, um, uh, on this course, we're actually going to find the Pokemon sign, which is pretty early on. Spoiler. <laughs> and also, since we have new items, we can actually, um, get ourselves some more, um, well, not some, oh, jeez, is, is that a Pidgey? Okay, well, anyways, we can we actually we can actually can get some better pictures of new Pokemon and also um, get new Pokemon. <laughs> so first of all, since we have apples here, gonna lure Pikachu over there to that surfboard, and you've guessed it. Well, Pikachu disappeared. <laughs> okay, Pikachu, get over, and Pikachu gets on the surfboard and does a cool pose, and that is the surfing Pikachu. And over here, we take a picture of this. Ro strange rock formation. So, take a picture of that. And if you do, if you recall, the very first episode of this uh this let's play, I said to um, remember that for later. And well, that there it is. So that that actually that rock formation is actually our Pokemon sign, and is actually um a Kingler. It's in the, the form of a Kingler. So, you know, we're just gonna speed it up here. There's a Pokemon that I do want to get. Well, will take a picture of me off for just for fun. So, the Pokemon I want is in here, and I have had so much trouble getting it. I don't know, not I do not know why. There it is. Oh my God, yes, beautiful. Okay, so that is taken care of. We can. Oh wait, what was that? Oh, that is, that was weird. <laughs> Anyways, so oh, just two two Pikachu's here. So let's uh die. Oh, sorry. Anyways, no, no, okay, so get back up there, and if we take a picture of these two, isn't that cute? I think, um, you can get these two Pikachus there by, um, by, um, what's it called? Darn. Darn, I don't remember. By, um, throwing pester balls in the grass, and if you hit them right, I guess, you should be able to get the, those two Pikachus. So, the Pokemon that we got, the new Pokemon that we got, I should say, is, uh, the Scyther, and you can only get it by throwing a bunch of pester balls in here, and I'm so lucky that I got it, because... Because it, it takes uh, quite a while, and it's um, very unpredictable. So, right here, I'm going to throw a pester ball at this, and you should get Chansey. We could not get this last time. Because last time, if you took a picture of that, it would turn out um, as a question mark. And if we throw some apples here, I said, you know what, pester ball! Yes! Alright, so that was pretty good. So now we have a better picture of Kangaskhan. And that, you know, I, I, do, I do recall that last time we, um, or the last picture we took was, a uh, 240, but anyway, since we, uh, have the dash engine, we can just speed up our way to the exit. Oh, jeez, it's not working. Well, whatever. Well, I guess when you get to very close to the end, you can't use the dash engine at all, but it still helps. Anyways, getting on to the lab. Dun, dun, dun. Alrighty. So, we have taken, uh, 30 pictures. Not bad. So, I'm kind of, I'm kind of in a dilemma here, because I have this, I want to take a picture, we don't want to take that for sure, that's the Pokemon sign I was talking about. We have Snorlax, pretty much the same thing, we'll just go for the first one. Mm, you can choose Surfing Pikachu, or we can choose, or just, let me just choose that, and, oh, Scyther, Scyther, we want Scyther for sure. <laughs> mm, even though he's not facing toward me, I'll just pick one of these. So. I think I've made my choice, and I'm gonna choose the Pikachus that are right here, because I do believe that that gets you more points, I'm not sure. And it also has to go, it has to go against the, the Pikachu picture that we took last time. So, Kangex gone. So, best one... Well, that looks pretty good. So, let me just check that we've taken all the pictures that we wanted, and... We should be alright. So, let's show these to Professor Oak, and get ourselves our first Pokemon sign. What's new this time? Snorlax. 
it says a Snorlax. That was a size 420, even though you get a lot of more sides, because if you don't know, Snorlax is huge. Anyways, how's the pose? It is scratching its tummy. 1,000 points! How's the technique? Okay, but when it's right in the middle frame, she rack up us 2,840 points. Alright, alright. So, getting on to Meow. So, I'm just going to skip this one, since we already have it. Oh my god, we have 3,220 points, which is a lot more than what we got last time. So, we did extremely well. Scyther, so let me see, this is a Scyther. Oh, shoot, I skipped that. But anyways, total is 340, which is, wow, really good. <laughs> Alright, Pikachu. So, wow, isn't this Pikachu on the stump? And if you get the surfing one, which um, I'm not going to show, but I, I showed you how to get it, so if you're playing along. So, this is the Pikachu on the stump. This Pikachu on the stump has a value of... 1,300 points, Pikachu's picture in the Pokemon report, eh? so already from the start, we already know that the, the one on the right is going to get us a lot more. So as opposed, oh, it's very lively, 1,250 points. That was a tag, oh my gosh, oh my god, 5,880 points, whoa, that is, that is the most I've gotten, in, in like on any picture. <gasps> 6,000? Six thousand one hundred and eighty points. That is the most I've gotten on any picture. I, not even the balloon Pikachu got has gotten me that much. Wow, I've never done that before. Okay, so Chansey here and nine hundred. Oh, I'm just amazed. Anyways, nine hundred and sixty points for the Chansey. How's the pose? One thousand. On uh, technique, okay, it was right in the middle frame. Should wreck us up three thousand nine hundred twenty points. Wonderful, wonderful. wonderful. King's Kong. Okay, so we're just gonna skip that. So, obviously, we did a lot better. We got 3,600 points. And I think that's it. Oh, the Pokemon sign. Oh. oh. <laughs> this is exactly the Pokemon sign I'd be looking for, obviously. And uh, we don't get any points for that. But it's gonna register in our, um, our Pokemon report, I guess you could say. Wait! Bernie! Let's return to the lab! Alrighty then. So, returning to the lab. Welcome back. You take pictures at a good pace. Here to make- Whoa, I've never heard him say that. I don't know if you heard that, but he said, Here's a present for you. It will come in handy for taking Pokemon pictures. Would you like to see the rare Pokemon poses? Play this Pokefloat to make it happen. It's easy to use. Press down on the C, the C button. It allows you to play a Pokeflute. And it's, uh, I think there's four types of uh, songs that you can play. And there's uh, actually a cool thing you can do with uh, Pokemon. You can listen to different types of music. See, I, I said before, I try playing often. Then we can get um, different sorts of Pokemon, different poses, and this will help us for uh, further, further courses. So um, we're at the seven-minute mark here. So I kind of want to do another course, but that might take us a little bit of a while. So you know what? This is gonna be a kind of a short episode. So. I'm going to leave all you guys here, so thanks for joining me, and I hope you enjoyed watching this, and I'll see you guys later.